it's less an inspiration and more a need. I think just as a singer needs to sing, whether it's in the bathroom or wherever, publicly, a singer, somebody who loves singing, sings, they just have to do it. A person who loves running is really aspired to just do it. Whatever, whatever is your true passion, you do it. And so I, for me, it is writing. If, if too long a time passes, I have to set aside some time for writing because that's just the passion that burns inside of me. In terms of the subject matter of this particular publication, it's really, it's called a diary, but it's, it's not a diary in a strict sense where I have been keeping, you know, a secret book with notes and very, from a day-to-day -day basis. It's, it's really just bits and pieces of my experiences uh, as a judge, as a former politician, uh, as a traveler of the world, as an observer of life, as a discussion, as a discusser of of issues like religion, and, and it's a wide cross section of issues. So there are things that buzz around in my head that I need to think about and write about, and so that's how that came about, really, because I like writing and I have a need to express myself in writing. A recovering politician. Yes. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> well, you've heard about a recovering alcoholic, right? So, so you have to be strictly careful because anytime you might slip back. But really and truly, no, I think my, my days of uh, politics are over. It sounded like a nice, catchy title. Mm -hmm. um, so while we're all interested in politics because it's so ingrained in, especially in small societies, and so much turns on politics that one has to stay tuned.